Hi guys, my name is Chad Trofgerben and you are watching Chad Chat. So today I thought I would do something a little bit different, something a little bit fun, and that is give you my top three requests for the new version of Anime Studio. Now, no new version has been announced as far as I know, and we have no idea when a new version is coming, but it's always fun to kind of speculate and give suggestions because you never know. Someone out there might be paying attention and your suggestions might make their way onto the new version of Anime Studio. So here will be my top three suggestions. If you have any suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comments and we can discuss them and maybe I'll talk about them in an upcoming Chad Chat. So my first suggestion would be the ability to open up multiple project files within Anime Studio. Now, you can kind of do this already. You can have a project file open, then you double click on another project file and it launches basically a second copy of Anime Studio. However, I like the way that Flash does it in which you have Flash open and then as you open up project files, they become tabbed at the top of Flash. So then, if you want to go from one project file to the other, you can just simply click on the tabs. And this is great if you want to reference past project files or if you want to copy assets from one to the other. And so, I think if anything like that could be implemented into Anime Studio, it would be a huge help, especially with projects that have multiple project files. Number two, I would love the ability, and this seems a little bit far-fetched, However, it is possible um, to auto-rig your characters when you bring them into Anime Studio. And the reason why I say it's possible is because I recently found a video from Mike Kelly on YouTube where he demonstrates a script that he's working on that allows you to do this. And I definitely recommend that you check it out. I'll link to it on the video here. And you can basically bring a character in and his script will auto-detect where the body parts are and somehow just draw the bones in and from there you just have to go in and do some small tweaks and get the uh, get everything up to speed. Now the script hasn't been released yet however I can imagine um, if the script is possible that he's working on that the Anime Studio team can somehow implement it into the vanilla version of Anime Studio. So definitely I think something to think about and hopefully they explore that option as they work on the new version of Anime Studio. And finally number three, this is kind of a, I don't know, this is kind of harder to explain, but I wish they could somehow optimize Anime Studio to work a little bit better with detailed projects. With my recent cartoon, A Voyager, The Seiki Truth, available on Trough Ruben Films, if you want to go and check that out, um, I had some pretty detailed project files going on, and it was really bogging things down. Things were really choppy and slow as I was trying to work and get things done. And so I have a pretty uh, good computer, I mean, as far as specs and RAM and all that, and I've talk to people who also work with Anime Studio who run into this issue. So if they could somehow figure out how to streamline or optimize Anime Studio to work better with these more detailed project files, that would be terrific. But then again, I'm not a software engineer. I'm just a ginger who does chat chats and does tutorials. So I don't know that end of the, uh, the process. But anyway, those are my top three requests for Anime Studio. If you have any, please leave them in the comments and we can discuss them and maybe I'll talk about them in an upcoming Chad Chat. If you're looking for more Chad Chat, please subscribe because I will then be able to deliver Chad Chats to your front door or to your computer screen with ease. And if you are looking for more tutorials, please check out IncredibleTutorials.com. If you're looking for premium tutorials for extensive courses, there is IncrediblePhiles.com. And if you're looking for one-on-one -on -one tutoring, I offer that through IncredibleTutoring.com. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.